mama ko kasi tsaka I kind of grew up around a musical household. Mm-hmm. My mom sings, my grandma, my mom's mom plays mm-hmm. the piano. Oh, my wow. cousins, like you know, Ninong's uncles, mm-hmm. they're all around music. Tsaka yung mga sa simbahan. But mm-hmm. what really like got me interested is like being around my grandma and my mom. Mm-hmm. And one time, pinapakanta kasi nila ako. Eh. Alam mo yung mga Pilipino, oh, just kanta ka dun. Yes. Hindi ako na masusunod. <laughs> Kahit nahihiya ako, nialabas ko pa rin. But, mm-hmm. um, yeah, so my mom kind of like trained me. Most, I kind of owe it all to my mom. Kasi, siya yung parang nag-guide sa akin na to get, to find the tone that mm-hmm. I feel like I own. But I feel like I'm still looking for it, but I think I'm getting closer to it. Mm-hmm. But siya yung nagturo sa akin maginig, mm-hmm. bukas ng bibig. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And it's usually around church kasi nakanta kami sa simbahan. I kind of oh, grew wow. up around choirs and stuff. But after that, nakikita niya na parang medyo magaling ako. So pinupush niya ako na ano, kahit mahihain ako eh, nung bata ako, mm-hmm. lalo na. Mm-hmm. Pinupush niya ako na pinupush. Eh, ako naman nakagalit. <laughs> Kaya lang, Which is natural. It's lang. natural. Kaya mm-hmm. lang, honestly, I'm really thankful that she pushed me. Kasi yun din naman ang gusto ko eh. Nahihiya-hiya pa ako. Pagdating ko ng college, sabi ko, man, nagsaya ako ng oras. Yun din pala gagawin ko. Mm-hmm. Diba? So ngayon parang, but it's okay. It's never too late yeah. naman eh. But yeah, I feel oh, like naman, it's just started. Napaka, ang dami pang, marami pang uh, opportunities ang darating. Diba? Since napakabata mo. Wow, parang ang tanda ko na talaga. Uy, bata ka rin naman eh. <laughs> Oo, pero syempre, um, ayokong kalimutan na you came all the way from San Diego. Mm-mm. Wow. <laughs> Wow, guys. Yun okay. talaga yun. Dedicated. Sobrang, sobrang <laughs> salamat talaga for, for being with us for this uh, episode. And shout out to your mom. Mm, of course. Siyempre, di ba? All out support yan. Mm. Okay. So, ang next uh, question ko naman sa'yo is, you recently graduated from college. Yes, ma'am. Can you tell us more about it? <laughs> it's been a ride. It's been a, it's okay. been a journey. Mm-hmm. Kasi, I switched my majors like, Three times. Gusto mm-hmm. maging music major. Mm-hmm. And I tried computer science and I went to psychology. Mm-hmm. And yung pagdating, kasi nag-start ako mag-be out there with like music stuff. Mm-hmm. Probably siguro mga 2020, 2021. Mm-hmm. Around like after COVID. But yun nga, I just kept doing it and doing it. Mm-hmm. From music to computer science to psychologist. Mm. Grabe yun, guys. Oh. It's weird. You know? It's been a journey. Kaya lang, oh yeah, it's been a journey kasi towards the end of the semesters, mm-hmm. parang ayoko na mag-school eh. Mm-hmm. Kasi nag-gig ako palagi and it's busy, mm-hmm. so parang akong trumpo palagi. Mm-hmm. And I also have gigs sa City Walks too, sa Universal City Walks. So mm-hmm. sometimes even on like a Friday mm-hmm. after school, balik-balik ka and gabi na maka It's like, it's tough, but like, ito talaga gusto ko gawin. So of I course. feel like it's all worth it at the end. And oh, hard work man. will always pay off, mm-hmm. I feel like. Importante rin talaga na um, mahal natin talaga yung ginagawa natin, di ba? And um, maiba po ako. Po? No, oh, okay lang. <laughs> maiba ako. Siyempre, di ba, sabi nila pag... For me, ah, pag nakakakita ako ng psychologist, parang they know how you act. Tama ba yun? Mm-hmm. Like, nala- meron certain, certain uh, like, ginagawa na masasabi niyong kinakabahan. Mm-mm. Or meron? Pwede, pwede. Minsan. Meron. Ano, mga fidget fidgets, you can see that right oh, away. Oh, like sa kamay, Mm-mm, mga ganun. Or pati gagalaw-galaw, makikita mo nagtatap ng leg. And oh. There's like little things like that. But, so, <laughs> a- anong, anong tingin mo sa akin ngayon? Oh, comfortable, comfortable. <laughs> Master cheap. <laughs> Master Professional. <laughs> Wait, pero congratulations sa yeah. You already uh, graduated college. Thank you so much. And ayun na nga, since kanina medyo nahapyaw natin yung about sa family mo uh, when you introduce your family. Ito namang next question ko ay medyo personal question. Okay. And I think it's a taboo, lalo in our community. What mm. can you say about Filipino parents supporting the artistic and creative careers of their children? Mm. My mom's, my parents, my dad, supportive sila talaga. Like, mm-hmm. gusto nila akong magawa kung anong gusto kong gawin. Mm-hmm. Um, kaya lang, syempre, hindi natin alam kung gano'n tayo makakalayo sa ating mga pangarap. Mm-hmm. So, kailangan may backup plan din tayo. Kaya, mm-hmm. naintindihan ko rin ang pagka-support nila at yung pagka-force nila. Kasi, syempre, like, once you're out in the real world, mm-hmm. you know, wala nang support. And then music can only do so much pagka, if you're still in like my shoes right now or something, mm-hmm. hindi pa tayo yung, 
big name or anything like that. Like, doing what we love, you know? But supportive sila. Like, they always bought me, like, guitars when I was younger. Kasi na-addict ako dun sa video games na on. Yung mga Guitar Hero. Mm-hmm. Yung nung parang nag-spark sa akin talaga eh. Binila na ako nun. Binibilan na ako ng mga guitars. And so, nag-start ako mag-gigs. Ako na bumibili ng mga gamit ko. Sarili mm-hmm. ko. But, Honestly, supportive talaga rin sila del. Pati nga kung saan ako napunta, kahit sa city walk, sila rin kasama ko kasi gusto oh, nila wow. So, it's really it means a lot to me and I'm really blessed to have supportive family like that. Even though I know it's taboo and I know a lot of people who also go through things differently, mm-hmm. I I feel like I'm blessed and fortunate to have that type of support system in my side. Yes. And sobrang ano din 'yun since lagi kong sinasabi sa lahat din ng mga naging guests, di ba? Na sobrang importante rin talaga yung you have your family support, mm-hmm. di ba? With your with your music, with your career, and with your uh, in your case, uh, nakikita ko talaga kasi syempre kasama mo ngayon, di ba? Si mm-hmm. mama mo mm-hmm. and uh, on how she supported si you talaga, di ba? Yan shout out to kay <laughs> mommy. Hello. Oh, oh <laughs> na- nakakatuwa na you came all the way talaga na pagkalayo-layo just to be here on this show. And I'm, I'm really grateful for that. Diba? Me too. Na, Me too. Um, uh, until yon hanggang, hanggang doon talagang sinusuportan ka ng family mo. And uh, yung sabi mo nga na uh, grateful ka, diba? And blessed. Mm-hmm. Diba? To have them. So, have them. Uh, thank, thank you. God, you know. mm, thank you so much. Pero, Um, eto, personal question ko na lang siya kasi syempre we still, a lo- we have a lot of time. Oh, yes. <laughs> okay, so, um, ano pa yung mga other instruments na piniplay mo? Ooh. Well, my main instrument is gitara. Gitara talaga ako. Like, mm-hmm. yun yung parang strong side ko. Mm-hmm. Kaya lang, since I'm also writing songs and producing my songs, I have to, I don't have to, but it's better kasi gusto ko rin pumuno ang sound ko. So, I play yeah. the keys. Mm-hmm. I play a little bit of drums. Mm-hmm. Tsaka, It's pretty much it. I play the flute, but like when I record stuff, it's pretty much just like the keys. Because mm-hmm. the keyboard got MIDI. Siya. I don't know if Ooh. you know what MIDI is. Yung parang like, napa plug in mo, and then you can change the sound. So it could be piano, it could be drums. Oh yeah. So mm-hmm. pwede kong gawing drums yung keyboard. Ko. But I also can play the real drums. But it's more convenient because the room ko ginawa ko studio, mm-hmm. and I just have a piano there. So whenever I just get the ideas, yeah. Pag may biglang tumulog, <laughs> wala nang tulog. <laughs> Alas ko na ng umaga, gising mm-hmm. parin ako naga ano. Pagka ano talaga, pagka may ideas, kasi mm-hmm. malimutin ako eh. Oh, so as soon as we get the ideas, I just try to mm-hmm. get it all down. Or mm-hmm. pati yung sa phone, yung voice memo app ko, uh, punong puno yun ng puro mga, ah, parang mga ano yes. lang, mga chords, mga melody. Mm-hmm. Just kasi gusto ko talagang, mga kote, sayang yung ano ko, yung oh. mga ideas. Yun, yeah. Kinakalimutan ko lang, mm-hmm. di ba? Mm-hmm. Which I can relate talaga. Kasi with my first ever own composition under my production and R- RGA Productions mm-hmm. um, yung walang iwanan na record ko siya madaling araw na din mm. so hindi ko sure kung yun ba talaga yung time na <laughs> <laughs> na nag 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 came up ng yung mga ideas mm-hmm. di ba pero siguro with with uh, in my case pag hindi makatulog di ba dun tayo mas magaham ng mga mm, yung mga melody Oo, oh, oh, di ba? Lisa, hindi ka rin pinapatulog nun dahil naririnig mo lang mm. kahit nakapikit na mata mo, di ba? Oo, oh, oh. and <laughs> ah, ginawa ko din yung ginagawa mo na inire-record ko siya kasi sayang, di ba? In my case, kasi parang ang, ang na-experience ko is uh, after 10 seconds, ma- makakalimutan ko na kung ano yung mm-hmm. melody na pumasok sa isip ko. So, kahit 10 seconds, ganun mm-hmm. talaga. Oo, oh, oh, di ba? Sulat, record. <laughs> Sulat, record, and talagang maalala talaga yun eh, kahit anong paraan. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 